Thank you for talking to us right now. I know this is difficult. Talk to me about where you feel, feel you went wrong in that performance. Uh, I underestimated his work from the bottom. Uh, the elbows were, were hard. And, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, I think it's probably tough for me to go up and wait too. Uh, the weight cut kind of killed me a little bit. So I could feel it going into the, to the third especially. Did you feel like between the weight cut and the staph infection we just found out about, do you feel like your system was depleted before you even stepped into the octagon? Yeah, uh, I took four fights this year. It was, a, it was a big step up for me. Uh, I felt like I took the big challenge, and, you know, I worked my ass off for it, and it just didn't go my way. I mean, you know, what can I say? I, I worked really, really hard for this, and uh, I felt like it was my time, but, you know, Tony was the better man tonight, and, you know, I'll be back, and I'll be stronger. Uh, probably time for me to go up and wait, too. You know, I, I'm standing here 185 pounds. It's a little too uh, – the staph infection – really didn't help at all with the weight cut especially right, absolutely well do you feel like this is a time where you need to take maybe an extended break to let your body heal and kind of take that time that you didn't have because you had so many fights in such a short amount of time yeah um you know i'm still one of the youngest guys in the division but uh you know i got the most fights you know so uh, i've been fighting frequently this is what i love to do this is where i feel most alive uh I stood up and I tried to take the, you know, the biggest challenge out there. I always said that Tony Ferguson was the toughest fighter in this division, and I stand by that, and he still is. Uh, he's, he's a rightful champion. Uh, we come from the same all the matter. It's, it's always been nothing but respect. So I hope he goes out there and gets it done. Well, thank you for sharing your thoughts with us. Very classy of you, Kevin. We appreciate it and really look forward to see what's next for you.